David, it's been a very well attended event today. This is two companies, one day, one event. What's it all about? Yeah, what we, um, what we wanted to do was um, get an opportunity to show the new VM5 uh, machining center. And at the same time, uh, Hypermill wanted to hold an event here um, and show everyone their new um, Max machining software. And it, and it has worked well, the collaboration. I mean, you, you've had a lot of people through the door. Yeah, we have. We have a lot of um, joint customers, so people who have open mind software and also use Herco machines. But we thought it'd be an opportunity for those customers who have Herco machines, who don't know that much about CAD CAM programming, and vice versa, really, people who have open mind software and don't really know all the things we can do on the machine inside. OK, so it's a good joint venture. Now, let's get on to this machine. New to the range, VM5. Tell us about it. Okay, yes, the, um, the reason for bringing out the VM5 was we've had a very popular machine in the VM1, which became the VM10. What we found was through demand, people wanted extra travel, bigger tool changer, through spindle coolant, faster spindles and so forth. And the VM10s ended up growing and being more, more than it originally was. There's still a requirement for simple work drilling four holes in a, a piece of steel, um, doing simple profiling. And also a lot of our customers work in very small workshops. So what we wanted to do was get a small footprint machine, good machining center performance for the sort of simple work and the straightforward options and things like that. It looks in a very, very tidy footprint. Now has this got the latest control from Herco as well? Yes, it has. It's got the uh, Max 5, so all the full capabilities. I think you can see it moving behind. It's very fast, smooth motion, has our multi-motion software, has all the capabilities that you get from the most advanced machining centers. So the VM5 itself, just, just remind me of the capacity of it and what you get with the spindle and what comes when this hits the deck in your machine shop. Okay, yeah, we're starting it as an entry-level machine. Um, it's 456 in X by 356 by 356. Um, 8,000 RPM spindle. Um, the big selling point really is 1.64 across um, to get into a door, and we can get it under two meters um, as well. So and it's the smallest machine we've, we've produced. And, and that does make a difference because engineers want to get as many spindles in a smaller area as possible. Yes, that's, that's exactly correct. You, you wouldn't believe how often um, it's um, the sales totally down to what we can fit in. They want a Herco, please can I get it in through the door. They give us some dimensions and we do, we do pride ourselves on what we can get through the door and um, what you get here is a proper functioning machining centre in a small space. And they're available now from stock? Yeah, available X stock um, and we're doing a nice deal on the X demo machine here at 29.9 at the moment. Good stuff, thanks David. Thank you very much.